Good evening, everybody. It is Sunday. And for Sunday, it is chill streams and dredge. And I don't know how much longer we have to go in dredge. How's everybody doing? Hello, hello. I see Pulte, I see Bad Code. Welcome in. Sheebs, how's it going? I hope that works, because I don't know if I can reach further forward than this and still have things track. So that might be all we can do. I'm gonna give it another minute or two, let people drift on in. Pulte asks, best pizza crust? Um, Depends on where you're ordering from. I don't know. Bad Code asks, what is a dredge? Uh, in this case, dredging would refer to a ship at sea pulling stuff up from the bottom. Generally, dredging involves uh, pulling stuff up from a, the floor of a body of water. So dredge as a game, though, is a horror fishing simulator, I guess. It's, it's a thing. We'll see what happens. Pulte says Domino's. I I don't know. Domino's is is okay. Probably just their regular stuff. We catch scary fish, big monsters training us occasionally. Otherwise, it's kind of chill. So it's what I'd classify as a comfy horror game. Do, do, do. And I'm trying to remember where we were when we ended last sheep says imagine we playing we play fishing plus subnautical violence kinda yeah sorta give everybody some free ear waggles and if dredge is not your thing come back in tomorrow same time for more uh, Tarkov Got kind of a good spread coming up over the week. It's Tarkov tomorrow, Sons of the Forest on Thursday, and then Layers of Fear on Friday. You want to grab them. What are we grabbing? Cheese. Thank you for the cheese, Sheebs. Uh, what kind of cheese is it, though? Ears. I mean, you generally probably shouldn't just grab ears. That sounds painful. Yeah, Sheebs, is it, are we talking about Gouda, Cheddar, Havarti, Swiss, Lindberger? What do we got? What kind of cheese? It's a projectile cheese, so mozzarella. I imagine of all the cheeses, the, the kind of fluid dynamics of mozzarella would probably be lending themselves well to uh, projectile, like throwing stuff, launching from things. Beans, look at the beans. There you go. Some beans. The kind you put into a catapult. I mean, okay, so you're talking about wheels of cheese at that point. Do. Cartons of cheese. I don't think cheese comes in cartons. Cartons of cheese sounds a little, um, a little sus, a little suspect. I don't think the crates of cheese might do it. Okay. Cheese. Hi, you. What kind of cheese are you throwing? The little cheese wheels that are in wax covers. The um. <laughs> The I just had some of these baby bells, baby bell cheese. Yo yo has contributed 250 points to the retexturing Jeez. stream. Nice. Sheebs is throwing more cheese. Okay, get it out of your system now. There's there's tons uh, before it goes away. Bad code says, I used to get all the wax together and then put a string in it to make a candle. That makes some sense. I think I knew somebody who did that before. But that's good use, a good good repurposing. It's not much, but a bit closer. I mean it's it's an amount. We're at 
9% currently. I made it intentionally very, very high. We'll see if we hit it. And Sheebs get cheese. Easy. All right. And give it two seconds and bam, we're going live. Boxy's contributed 8,000 points. Sizable con contribution. I don't know what that puts it at. I can't click into it without destroying the game sound now. We are at Starlight Pontoon, which means we're back where the giant thing in the water was after we had... What did we do? We got... Oh, we got the deep stuff. We got the deep sea testing stuff. We're at 10%? Nice. Excellent. I'm sure everybody will be thrilled to watch me vaguely remember... Nice. How to do... Uh... Texturing in Substance Painter, and then we can see about updating this guy and or um, and or make a new kind of imagination imagining of them, perhaps. We do have some fancy fishing rods. We've just unlocked the bottomless lines, and I've got the fathomless winch. I was prepared for this with the research parts. We have spares. That's good. Which means we need to purchase those if we can, but I think we're poor. We do have fish, though. I didn't realize we were still carrying a bunch of fish. Uh, do, 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 fish market. Buy my stuff. Sweet. Poor is the way. It is. It is the way it occurs. It's the way it happens. Okay. So we have a harvesting platform. We have the sampling device. Oh, we can't fit the winch. Can we fit the bot? Oh, we can. Okay, bottomless lines we can do. That's gonna give us Hadal and Abyssal layer, coastal shallow oceanic. So the only thing we can't fish currently is um, the mangroves, but I don't think we're going back over there anytime soon. Okay, needs to be attached to a generator. I don't... We have to take that somewhere, so we gotta kinda also figure out what was happening. Which should be in... Pursuits. Okay, light the statues, no. Stone tablets. Collect all samples. Uh, I need to call, uh, connect the repulsion machine to the generator at the research outpost. I, we can do that. And then an anglerfish, a loose jaw, a giant amphipod, and a snailfish. wonder if the giant amphipods are like giant isopods. Because that'd be cool. Our friend in the depths is a little upset and... You know, that's understandable. I also didn't realize it was nearly evening. Okay, that was close. So we're going to kind of skirt around until we find the research station. And then I'm not sure where we should go to actually get the samples. We'll figure that out next. Probably right here. I mean, we could probably stop right here and get these. What are you? Oh, anglers. Nice. Oh, still so terrifying. Always terrifying, but also one of the kind of coolest fish down in the abyssal layer. We're also tiny, like obscenely small. So we'll hand one of these in and then we'll sell the rest. Because I don't know what these are worth. Ugh. It's a xenomorph. It's a xenomorph angler. Impressive. I'm going to save a little bit of space. 
Okay, we need to hook this up to a generator. Generator. The researcher's repulsion machine could be connected to the outpost generator here. Okay. A small object rolls out from under the generator covered in dry salt. Oh, sweet, a research part. Do we activate it? Yeah, yes. The repulsion machine hums and whirs to life. A few seconds later, a bright light shoots from the top and an alarm begins blaring. The researcher said she this should keep the creature at bay for a time at least. Nice. Okay, so we should be able to... Oh yeah, I don't see it anymore. It's just, it's curled up down there. Okay. I think we're safe, which means we can grab whatever this is. What are you? That is real uncomfy. Oh, that is, that is so very uncomfortable. Mm. It's just, it's waiting down there. Snailfish. Gross. It's all goopy. And you, what are you? Also snailfish. You are... a valuable... So we're dredging for these right now. We've got stuff dragging along the bottom. We pick up doubloons. We pick up doubloons. And then we carry on about our business. You are going to be snailfish. And that's not great. That's bad timing. Bad timing. No. Okay, you can have that. You can have that. Thank you. Is this all going to be treasure? Is this just from things that's crushed? Sapphire earrings. Okay, I mean, it's, we need money. This works. Can't catch that thing. Mookie, hello, how's it going? We don't need more anglerfish. What is that? What are you? Why are you here? I've never seen you before. What is this? That one's not scary. It's really cool. What are you? You're like a, a manta ray, but violent. Uh, I don't think you can stay in the shallows. Excellent. Okay. All right. Luki says, good, hot. This game looks like so much fun. Yeah, I would recommend it. Dredge has been, like, weirdly cozy horror throughout the whole thing. Um, it's not super expensive right now. Or ever, really? I don't think this is... Like, fuck, I didn't need to sell all of those. That's fine. No, that's fine. Uh, I don't think it's ever really too expensive. And it's not super heavy. So if you can, I would... That is... No longer subdued. I'm gonna have to be a little careful. Dylan Devious raided with a party of eight. Thank you very much. Can we get a shout out for Dylan? Hello! How's it going? We're doing some dredge. My name is Justin Thulu. I'm a variety streamer. Streaming on Sunday, Monday, Thursday, Friday, 7 p.m. Pacific. We're currently towards the end of dredge. Playing only up? How's only up? I think we're at the end of Dredge. I don't know. We keep getting more stuff to do. This Dredge was such a good game. This is my first playthrough. We've been at it for a little bit. We're still lacking a bunch of story stuff, and I think I've kind of gone about it in a weird way, which is not unusual. Collecting some samples for the researcher in the Starlight Cove. 
at the moment. We just got our Hadel and Abyssal layer fishing equipment. These also look like anglers? Fangtooth. Teeny tiny little fangtooth. Okay. Dylan says, only up is fun, but very frustrating. That kind of meshes with what I've seen. <laughs> How far did you get? Like, what was what was your best? I'm curious. I think all the blue lights are going to be octopus. Sheep says it's a rage game, like getting over it. Yeah, that's kind of what I've gathered, is it's it's super... Super frustrating every now and again. Need these to upgrade, so we'll pick one up while we're out here. And then remember that there are more. Dylan says, yes it is, but getting over it is worse. Oh, okay. I don't know, I guess it would depend on whether or not you got a fear of heights, right? Like... Only up. Massive elevations. Falling from great heights. You got as far as the house with the balloons on it. Ah, you went to the up place. Sweet. You're gonna be more anglerfish. I can't fuck with whatever that is yet because I need to turn back on the thingy. Oop. I don't trust that you're not also an anglerfish. Dylan says, yeah, so I feel like my first time playing it went well. Nice. You got the skills. You got the only up skills. Was there any hint at an up sequel in only up? Is there any connection there? Okay, research lady, I need to hand you this fish so I can sell the others. So take the angler. You can have that. That's for you. That's a gift. Specifically from me. Enjoy it. Treat it well. I'm gonna sleep till morning. And now we're gonna leave. So we need another one of the... Uh... The eel-like things. The snailfish. And a few more. We need anthropods. I don't even know what to look for. Amphropods, right? Not isopods. Are you still dormant or are you going to eat me? Oh, I, I definitely need to go over there. Okay, we're going to try... It's kind of, maybe if we're really slow about it. Nope, 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 nope. He's getting angry. Just waving those tentacles a little, a little aggressively. Okay. New plan. Gonna need a bigger boat. This is bad Jaws reference. Just ignore that one. Um, we're going to need to turn this back on. Blah, blah. Yes. Activate the machine. Good movie. Yes, it was. Shark Week is soon, and I'm getting a real big implication. Or implication? Uh, uh, want, need, intuition. Hard to pronounce words stating I should probably watch it again soon. Just the first one, though. I didn't like any of the others. Like, the, the second and third and, I guess, fourth were garbage. Desire, probably. Had a small brain fart. It happens. Okay, so I got my isopod wannabes. I guess so long as that sound is in the background, we're fine. I hope. Got another sextant. You're rich in naval antiquity. And you sh Oh, yes. These are the ones I need. These are the snailfish. Perfect. 
and catch two of everything so I've got stuff to sell. Do the business sense stuff. And then the last one was... I don't remember what the last one was. Probably not those. And not those. So we caught some of those. Caught more of those too. Oh, it's gonna be right over the middle, isn't it? I'm gonna have to look down at that. That is just my nightmares. No, I've caught you. Ah. Uh. <laughs> ah! All right. I don't. I don't remember. I don't know what we're looking for. So we're gonna. It's just gonna be a matter of turning it back in. We'll move past where we got the dog. Do the thing. And I'm pretty sure the fortress was around this bend. Lightning! Storms are coming in. The seas are rough. We've made it back to the pontoon. We need to go over there. Refuse to meet Davy Jones this day. Whatever the hell his locker is. Ah! Mmm. Bad mist. Don't whisper at me. Don't plorp at me either. What the fuck was that? Just come to the surface to make weird noises? What the fuck? You. I gave you the dog, I give you fish. You get fish? Oh, loose jaws. Okay, so those are supposed to be like gulper reels. Have your amphipod. Where the fuck do I find these? Where do I find those? Uh. I don't even know where to begin to look. Are these them? I mean, they're red and violent looking. What are you? They are them! Red and violent looking. Terrifying. What was the best interpretation of a... Gulper eel and or anglerfish in a video game that you've ever seen. Or that shocked you the most. I'm curious. Have your last sample. While we wait. Take this from me. I do not wish to possess it. Sheep says I'm not sure. That's fair. I mean, I guess it would also kind of depend on how many aquatic-based games you've played. Good news and bad news. Which do you want to hear first? The bad one. The bad news is that the samples you retrieve from the basin have dangerously high counts of cellular mutations. The good news is that I've honed in on what's causing the abnormalities in the ecosystem. This all points to one thing. That thing in the basin is harmful to life at a cellular level. <laughs> Damages everything around it, whether passively or with intent. I need to write up a report on my findings. Sorry, our, our findings. Immediately. Maybe now they'll take me seriously. Oh, how rude of me. You've done all this for me and I've not got much to say thank you with. You should have this. A plan for the future. She opens the door and pulls out a book. Sheepishly, she hands it to you. This is something I wrote during my studies. I think it'll be useful to you. Thanks again for your help. I'd recommend that you avoid the area. It doesn't seem safe to be near the basin. You know, I'm I'm good with that. I, I don't ever have to come back here, and that's fine by me. We will start reading your book. And I will return to safer harbors and less giant tentacle action. Hello, Extreme. How's it going? We've just 
caught a bunch of really deep water samples and avoided giant tentacles. Those ones, actually. Those ones right there. It's just, it's waiting. It's, it's, oh, it's exploratory. I'm tempting fate. Come here. Come here. Do your thing. Okay, stop doing your thing. Too, too much doing thing. I think I've tempted fate enough. Sheep says we've gotten radioactive fish lore. Yes. Looks super creepy. Absolutely. And I'm going the wrong way. I need to go back to Little Morrow to sell a bunch of valuable stuff. And then we need to figure out what specifically we have to do. Because I don't know... I don't know. I didn't look it up. I should have done research. I think we'll probably need a bunch more money, so we're gonna have to divert and fish a bunch. Extreme says this game sort of looks like Sea of Thieves. A little bit. Yeah, no, definitely I can see the similarities Ooh, more anglerfish. That reminds me, I've seen a bunch of people playing Sea of Thieves recently, and I'm kind of tempted to go back and have a look. I think it would be a much better game if they had dedicated servers. Like, I understand the PvP is a, <clears throat> like, um, kind of core aspect. I, I don't always want to deal with Reapers. Dolphins. Um, and it kind of threw me off of it for a while. Sheep says you should, but you gotta do a pirate voice the whole way through. No, because that will shred my vocal cords. It's not happening. But I have played Sea of Thieves before on stream. Please tell me I'm going the right way. To the lighthouse, the obvious landmark that I should have been following this whole time. Curse games follow. Thank you very much. How's it going? Stream says, that's how I feel about it. I was getting tired of re- Yeah, especially during the event. I think it was like two seasons back. I got really big into it in 21. Like 20 to 21. Um, all the way to like the uh, Athena quests and stuff. And then I dropped it because they started to do the Reaper rep things. Curse Game says, fine, I suppose. I'm just lurking around. Well, welcome in. Thank you very much. My name is Justin Thulu, variety streamer. I play many types of games. However, recently we're currently stuck on some horror, some shooters, and some other stuff. Come on, Doc, already. Thank you, thank you. You, Trader Man. Purchase all of this valuable stuff. Excellent. Did we have any... We got doubloons. I don't know if we want to give up all of the doubloons. Well, I'll be lurking and enjoy your gaming. Thank you. I hope you have a good lurk. Back to the earlier question about anglerfish. I think that the... The, the best implementation of anglerfish in a game that I had was probably in Soma. I think the, the Soma section where you're walking along the bottom was probably the, the single scariest moment for me. Oh, <laughs> I got over ambitious. It just, just gave it the beans and went straight into the rocks. Too many beans. Too many beans given. Oh, the mayor. Fisherman, have you run into a photographer on your travels? She docked here a few days ago for supplies. Suggested that she take some pictures of the town for promotional purposes, but she doesn't seem too interested. 
She mentioned she was heading south. Perhaps you could introduce yourself. Maybe, I guess. There's a photographer. Is that important? Is this like a new level of content? Are we, are we progressing that fully? 150 bucks is kind of disappointing for those. A golden band large enough to fit around a child's waist. All manner of gemstones are affixed to it seemingly at random. That probably goes over to the weird cultist dude. Gonna uninstall this because I don't need it anymore. I don't think. Send it to storage. And then in storage, we have this. Can we fit anything around that? Like maybe some nets? Do we still have nets? Did we sell our net? No, they're right there. Okay. Wolf, how's it going? It's been a while. How you doing? We're playing Dredge. Fathomless Winch. I think we need that more than Bottomless Lines. So... 82%, 38%. Yeah, we're definitely going to get rid of this. Doing good, how about me? Oh, I'm doing pretty good. I have no space for this, though. That That is a problem right there. I think we'll sell the improved trawl net. Also, if anyone is inclined to do so, you can find stuff on all the places in those links. I am on TikTok, I'm on YouTube, and everywhere else. If you could go like and follow and all that stuff, that would be great. Doing pretty good on the TikTok recently. Install. Excellent. You can also type exclamation point TikTok and that'll take you right to it. Okay, so photographer seems to be the new thing. Catch rare fish. Done. We haven't done that at all. Uh, search for relics. Yeah, okay, so if we get the ring back to the collector on Blackstone, then we just need the necklace and the watch. Oh, we have the necklace. So we just need the watch. Okay. Can wrap that up too. That's definitely something we could do today. To Blackstone. Also, my lights seem to be affected. Probably because I'm damaged and didn't repair. That would explain a lot. You walk in and place the jewel-encrusted ring on a table by the collector. His eyes widen. We're certainly making excellent progress now, and I know what you're thinking. An item like this would fetch a fortune at any auction, but for us, its value transcends material wealth. Regardless, you do a reward. He opens the Crimson Book, its spine cracking audibly, selecting a page carefully. He begins to read aloud. The words sound muffled, as though he's speaking through a thick haze. You hear a growling crackling in your ears. Suddenly, your vision flares and both of your ears pop. He closes the book. We must keep searching. I've been thinking more on where we might find another. I can imagine all manner of detritus swallowed by the silly muck of the Twisted Strands channels. It's worth investigating. <coughs> Hello, Crimson. How's it going? Good timing. <laughs> Twisted channels are not fun. Uh, I'll mark a location on your map where you can begin your search. Anything else? Yeah, I got a necklace. Do you, do you want a necklace? Do I have to come back again for the necklace? I think I might. Crimson says, hello. I'm retouching my hair color at the moment. Nice. I hope that goes well. You enter the house carrying the ornate necklace. The collector recognizes it almost immediately. 
an excellent find. Demands pride of place in my collection. He sweeps aside some scraps on a dusty table, candle wax pooling in its corners, and he places the necklace carefully in the clearing. And I suppose you'll be demanding recompense as well. Once more, he opens the book, dust pouring from the pages as he reads aloud. You begin to feel weak, but you're rooted to the spot. Knees on the verge of buckling. As he finishes speaking, you feel blood rushing back to your legs. A strange feeling of power grows in your chest. We're so close. One remains. I loathe to suggest it, but the abyssal plane on the approach to Devil's Spine is the likely candidate. See what you can find. I'll mark a location on your map where you can begin your search. Anything else? No, I'm leaving. We gained magic powers. I don't remember what they were, but they did cool things, so that's cool. Devil's Spine is over here. The Ancient Ruins, I think, would be where we'd start looking. Also, Crimson, thank you for the contribution of 4,000 points to the retexturing stream. Drives us a little closer. I think there's like 24 days left on it, something like that. I'm going to guess here. I think we need to go here, so we'll hang a right. We'll go starboard. And then due north, past Great Morrow, Little Morrow, and Seal Point. We'll just go straight up there. You want that to happen? I think everybody seems to. But community goal is a community goal. Okay, so we were facing this way. We need to go starboard. Like so. And then due north. And I've finished my coffee, which is really unfortunate. You gotta send me some silly pictures of Bassy. Yeah? How's Bassy been? How's the cat? Get due north. You can also post them in the Discord, if you'd like. If they're something you think everybody should see. Or both. Either's fine with me. He's been good, very silly. Hey, Lee. Okay, that's a whale, that's fine. Whales are probably okay. Humpbacks, definitely. Orcas, not so much. Are we at our destination? We are. We're at our destination already. Nice. Do, do, what are we looking for? Okay, we got the beginnings of the Devil's Spine happening. We got the hot water. See, I mention orcas. I mention orcas, and then they show up. Cool. Are you going to be a problem? I hope not. It's found tissue paper. Nice. Ooh! Rocks. What do you have to tell me? What do you have to tell me? You approach a hooded figure. They are standing expectantly, vermilion red robes in the blowing the wind. Fishermen serve. The voice from the hood cuts through the humid air. Deliver the vessel. The hooded figure produces an old paper scroll. They pointed a shape on it of a cusk eel. The old probably lich in some robes wants a cusk eel. Interesting. Where would one find a cusk eel? Is it a head in the boiling, frothy water? No, that's a shark. I will take the shark, though. 
which is in volcanic water, which we can't interact with because we don't have the right stuff aboard. That's just the best. That is the best. That's a thermal vent. That's a thermal vent. Somewhere over there is our buddy, the giant anglerfish. That's cloth I don't need. Be right back. Okay. Have a good one. Uh, pontoon should be over there. Ooh, wait. What are you? What is this? Metal scrap. Perfect. Ah! Sweet. More wood scrap. Pontoons! Bad at spelling? No, it's fine. Enjoy your lurk. Thank you for throwing me on in the background. Ah! We've got rotten fish, because we didn't sell those tiny little dudes fast enough. Our lights are broken, which makes sense. We need to repair, but we also need to upgrade. Which we can no longer afford to do, because I bought stuff. Because of course. Because of course. Shipyard, 30 bucks, 30 bucks to repair things. That's fine by me. $315 for new headlights. Yep. Well, we're here. Okay, we still have the volcanic rod. Uh, let me check our things. So, abyssal, hadal, and oceanic. Coastal, oceanic, and shallow. Coastal, shallow, mangrove, volcanic. So, we can cover it if we reapply this. Pretty sure. And then we'll just have to play some Tetris. Okay. Coastal, shallow, mangrove, volcanic, abyssal, hadal, and oceanic. That should cover everything except... Nothing. That should actually cover everything. Right? Yes. Yes, it should. Okay. I think. Okay. C cask, eels. Shark. Get shark. Shark, probably worth money. Frilled sharks. Oh, he's big. He's real big. Interesting. There are a lot of kind of deep to strange sea creatures, which are very interesting. Armored sea robin. Don't think we need those. What are you? What is this? What's down there? Another filled shark. Excellent. Nope, this one's not frilled, it's twisted. Okay, all right. Damn. Uh, 
Oh no! Uh, shit, it's like Tetris all over again. Okay, uh, what if I put you there? Oh, I can't match those up. I can if I bring them all the way down here, though. And shove that up there. And then we'll have a little bit of space around everything. Fish Tetris. Fish Tetris. Don't want more sea, Robin. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What are you? You're probably also C. Robin. You need an eel. I don't even think there are eel up here. I think that's a further south type of thing. That's a big noise. It is big. Big noises. Some wreckage. Have I been over there? I don't know if I've been over there. Is it worthwhile going over there? The fuck is that? Ghost shark. Who you who are you gonna call? Ghost sharks. No, wait, Ghost Shark came up in a conversation in the Discord earlier. The one that just splashes out of random puddles and shit. We found the sci-fi channel shark. It happened. I was going to be all like Ghostbusters stuff because apparently there's another movie coming out and that's, that's fun and nostalgic and exciting. And instead we've discovered that we're in a B movie. This is not where I wanted to land. This is not my f floating pontoon. May even be a C-grade movie. No, because it's got it's good artwork, good direction, good sound design. But we've included the, the ghost shark for reasons unknown. So I think we're in a solid B. Don't even. Don't, sheebs, no. We don't need to... You don't need to get that punny about things. That's just... Awful. Why would you do this? How much does a sea shark go for? Fifty-one dollars. <laughs> Goes for fifty-one bucks. Don't use my own face to emote at me with puns. That's just a war crime. That is a war crime. How could you do this? I got distracted and realized I probably shouldn't have just bought things again. That's a problem. Okay, we, nope, we sold our fish. We sold it, we sold it already. It's gone, it's gone, it's gone, it's gone. Nope, we don't need to do that. If I were a cusk eel, where would I live? Probably over here, right? Directly south. That sounds like a thing. We'll go we'll go south. Let's go look for cusk eel. Mm -hmm. Yep. Those are not concerning lights in any way, shape, or form. What are you? Strange glowing temple thing and some rocks. What is this? Have I been here? I had to have been here before. You undock next to an old rowboat. Somebody is here. He's hunched over by the campfire, muttering to himself. You cautiously approach. Oh, buddy. Hey, friend. Did you. Did, did you throw it back? Ah, uh, what? What? The book. I don't understand. This is perfect. I can just choose my own answers. 
I'm not seeing things. It, it, it's really you, isn't it? Who do you think I am? He turns away, wringing his hands he speaks to the fire. It was him. Him and his damned wife. They dredged up that old book, but something... Something cloaked in the fog followed it out right through the boat. Boom! The man makes crude explosion noises and motions wide with his hands, still talking to the fire as though pantomiming the story to a child. It spoke. It, it said it was coming for our breath, that we wouldn't be needing it soon, and then darkness crashed down. An age later, some of us washed up on shore, and him still clutching that book. Throw it back! We cried as the fog rolled ashore. We thought, surely, it can still be undone. What are you talking about? Silver and crimson, the book covered in their blood. You're not making any sense. Throw it back! The man closes his eyes tight as he holds back tears. His voice falls to a whisper. Please, the lighthouse keeper, she saw. She knows where it came from, where it, where it needs to go. Uh... I think you need some food and a nap. I think you need food and a nap. What does the lighthouse keeper have to do with this? She saw it all, that ruinous day. Ask her, beg her, tell her I... He trails off, his face collapsing in sorrow. Tell me more about the book? Silver and crimson, silver and crimson. He rocks back and forth, staring through the flames. What do you know about the fog? It cloaks the calamitous thing. It's evil. Haven't you felt it? I... I... Look, buddy, at this point I've been chased by giant glowing tentacles, giant anglerfish, something massive approximating a sea dragon, and a giant octopus. So, which particular big evil are we talking about? The Crimson and Silver book, though, that's got to be the one from the dude at the house. What a strange diversion while looking for eels. That man needs a hug and also some food. Speaking of which, I need to go to my break and turn on my AC unit briefly. So if that was intriguing and you want more, go ahead and stick around for about five minutes while I stretch. It's a good time for you to get water yourself. You can find me and everything I do off and around stream by typing exclamation point links. If that's not your thing and you like TikToks, please go have a look there. And also YouTube. Anyway, I'll be back. Hang in there.
I'm back. Thank you, Sheebs and Jeremy, for throwing out links. Yes, I went to break real quick. However, that is now over. We are back. And this button happens. And then this one happens. Thank you, thank you for the welcomes. Still looking for eel. Still have to find eels. Um, still have to not get eaten by anything, which is always a pleasure. Crazy old mayor man was not something I anticipated running into. Oh, please don't. Oh, oh, there's two of them. Oh no. Uh oh. Uh, wait, 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 wait. We can, we can do something about this. No, that's into a rock. Bad idea. Huh? Get, get fucked. I win. Oh. Oh no. No, 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 no. Not the whispers. Okay. Alright, cool. Uh. There's salvage. Salvage is fun, but we don't need that. We need... What is this? Who are you? Have we been here? Steel point. Oh, it's the builder. It's the builder. Okay, we got some sleep. Crimson says, my hair color has been washed out. Time to see if it came out nice, nice. Hope it did. Ooh, Marlin. Come to me. Shit. Oh, it moves too fast. My timing's off. It is huge. Like, I know Marlin are big, but come on. Uh. Wait, oh, you better be worth money. You better be worth money. Hmm. I still have to fit eel in here and then go deliver him to strange lich. Just the worst. Looks much better now. Nice. I haven't colored my hair or beard in many, many a moon. Even when I did hair color, I don't think I ever actually dyed it. I think I used hair chalk and just did a temporary thing. Not eel. Are cusk eels freshwater? I think they might be. Are we just going in giant circles looking for a thing that's not going to be anywhere we go? Is it going to be in, like, the rock canyons? I'm willing to bet it probably is. It's probably over there. Well, I guess we can check the shallows. Maybe it's a shallow kind of thing. I mean, I don't know if eels are shallow in like a, a emotional availability or personality sense, but I guess it's up to them. How much are you worth? 113 apiece. Okay, that's that's doable. That's good money. Still have a pack of explosives. Still have a few other things. I could probably remount this. Save myself a little bit of space. I think I will. I think we'll do that. Because it shouldn't cost anything. So uninstall. Rotate. Reinstall. Crimson says I color my hair like three times a year. 
Some eels like deep water. Yeah, some do. Uh, but then there's also freshwater eel and other things. So I don't know. I don't know. Refined outboard engine. I, we don't need that. We don't need that. We do need to drop stuff in storage. No, we did that already. Probably need to get things out of storage, actually. Crimson says, all I know is eel tastes really good. It does. I had some yesterday. Yesterday. Um, 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 nothing to repair. Okay. Yeah, okay, Ingfell ruins back in here, there were a lot of eels, so I'm willing to bet that maybe the Cusk eel are down there, so we need to go south, east. Then we can hand things into the strange cult lich and maybe finish off a quest. That'd be cool. Actually make some story progress. I've finished reading a plan for the future. That is a lot of lights. Make a lot of lights. We got wind. We got a. Oh, we had a. We had a. Following wind. Interesting. All right. So. Somewhere in these waters. Uh, other than twisters, water spouts. Eel. No. Wreckage. Also wreckage. Also not eel. More wreckage. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep, yep. Uh, I could have sworn that there were eel back here. Like, I was certain of it. I, I was pretty sure that we kept catching some type of eel over here. Okay, those are not... That is... Debris. This is all debris. That's yet another water spout. Cool. Good. Love those. Shipwreck. I have to be misremembering this. There's no way. What are you? No. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No. <laughs> the minute I need them, all the eel, eel disappears. Uh, what about over this way? Nope, that's more wreckage. Over here? Mm. Mm hmm. Diesel says, ah, from one water game to another. Good morning. Good morning. What was your water game? How's it going, Diesel? Raft. I haven't played Raft in a long, long time. I was thinking about trying to get people together to play it at some point, but honestly, at this point, I've, I've seen it all. I've... 
played many, many hours, and I don't think I can effectively go back to it. Water spout! Ah! Although, I hear it got some updates, so maybe. I'm not going to discount it completely, but... I just don't see a reason. Especially not with endless skies. We have to get back to that at some point. I'm just gonna sleep. Uh, eel. You know, we can check the encyclopedia we always never look at. That is a thing we could do. Do, 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 do. coastal? Maybe it's in coastal. Mm-hmm. Nice. I'll take a look at it after stream. Diesel says, yeah, you can now recharge batteries and not, you know, throw them into the ocean. <laughs> Cheap one and not so in real life. Leave. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Serpentine mackerel. Okay, we're looking at aberrations. Oceanic. Abyssal Hadel, Volcanic Mangroves. I mean, it's in mangroves. Maybe they were over there. Wait, am I going the wrong way? Sergeant Fish, Gar. Longfin. Okay, so Longfin are over there. Vortex Interloper. Page one of five. I don't think we're reading this correctly. 19 is, yeah, we're going by like whole groups of pages. Is there a search function? I didn't realize there were this many different types of fish in this game. Loose jaw, snailfish, grouper, anglers, glowing octopus, barracuda. Gray mullets, tarpons, armored sea robins, snake mackerel, ghost sharks, spoopy sharks, blackfin tuna. That is immense. I don't know what that is. And I know we've caught something along those lines. We're into strangeness. Ghost of Blahages past. I would love a couple of additional Blahages. That would be amazing. What are you? Gray eel. No, that's not what we want. Perch, block, conger eel. Conger eel are shallow water. And tasty. In fact, if I could do like two more blahages, I think everything would be rounded up perfectly. Anglerfish, barracuda. See, we're back into skipping bunches of things. Grotesque mackerel, lumpy mackerel, all-seeing cod, fanged cod, three-headed cod, brood squid, snag squid, barbed eel, host eel, riddled flounder, tusked grouper, voltaic grouper, shard ray, Cleft mouth shark. You know, honestly, the Pokemon are getting a little out of hand. I don't even know which region these ones are from anymore. Bearded mackerel, scouring bass, gelatinous stonefish. Just, this is the worst. Parhelion jellyfish, blood snapper, perished loose jaw, savage barracuda. Bursting anglerfish. Entwined mullet. Blister tarpon. Ossified sea robin. Serpentine mackerel. Holy shit, it just keeps going. Thank you. Okay, we haven't caught this fish yet. We haven't actually caught cusk eels. So I've been going off of the wrong thinking this whole time. Our dude was over here at Devil's Spine. I have to believe that somewhere between Lil Morrow and the ancient ruins here, and or me and Devil's Spine, these eels exist. Now, I thought they'd be down here. 
this made sense to me because I was pretty sure I'd seen them before. But I think we need to go back north. Have another look. And I'm going to be marginally upset if I've passed, like, 20 of them. That would be rude. It would be rude. Something blurped. What blurped? I don't know what blurped. That's disturbing. I mean, things should identify themselves when they blorp. I don't think I'm wrong in my thinking, though. So, like, eel are generally creatures which exist in, in coral or caves or the sides of, like, sea mountains. The, the place, the shelves, where things just drop off into the abyss. They live in dugouts and other things in those spaces. So it would make sense to me that they'd be kind of in and around ruins or in and between island chains. Like that, that makes a, a logical sort of sense. Diesel, how dare you gorp at me? How dare you? That's back towards where we come from. Uh, what are you? Why are you? What is that? That was also a whale, but it's so much bigger. What are you? This is huge. What? Are, what is this? Why is this? Are you gentle or are you going to eat me? Are you a humpback or a blue? This has got to be a blue, right? Because the humpbacks weren't even this large. Oh, and it's just gone. Okay, that's why whales are creepy. They make weird noises and they disappear into the deep. I shouldn't say that. There was actually a time... I have a tendency to do, like, weird YouTube dives. Um, and for a while, under the Arctic ice, there are hydrophones. They also exist on the coastlines, like, for various reasons. And there used to be streams available for them on, like, YouTube and other places where you could listen in to, like, ice calving and whales and other things happening... So, as kind of a generalized white noise thing, I guess whales aren't that bad. But when they just appear and they're huge, that's a problem. Uh. So, we know we have a very large and aggressive friend out here somewhere. We also know that we need... We need the fish that exist here. Do do Diesel says, last year a humpback whale beached itself on a beach in Calmer, which is odd. They never really come into the Baltic Sea that often. I'm willing to bet it probably had something to do with naval activity. Uh, we get a lot of humpbacks here, and a lot of orcas. Orcas are dicks, like completely. Just orcas are the worst thing in the ocean. Um, humpbacks, though, are interesting. And they, they freak out quite a lot when the Navy does any sort of sonar testing or when subs and other vessels are moving through. So it wouldn't surprise me if there's some increased naval activity in the area and the whales got confused or upset and tried to flee and ended up finding the beach. No! You didn't see shit. Go away. What is this? What are you? Ah. 
No, eh. Do, do, hold on. Okay. Naka, hello. How's it going? Still looking for those eels. Those are not eels, that's debris. Oh, that's where you guys got stuck. Okay, I see. Screaming into existence. Why, though? Why must you scream? Ugh. It's all goopy. Diesel says, oh yeah, the Baltic has almost always been a naval hotspot for reasons I'm not willing to discuss for the sake of becoming political. Fair. I got bonked? Why'd I get bonked? Also, Naka says, battle bit. Battle bit is a thing that exists. Have you been playing it? How is it? I've seen a lot of good things about it. I own it. I have not opened it at all ever it's fun and hell fun as hell unless you're losing oh that's not really a thing of mine uh i don't well that's not entirely true Th there are moments where i'll kind of tip a balance and something isn't fun anymore unless we're talking about friends v friends which is kind of mediocrely fun the whole time but for games like battlefield or anything like a shooter like that you have to approach it with the sense that, you know, things are going to happen. If you don't have fun with it all the time, it's probably not for you. It reminds me of many an old Battlefield argument about, you know, games being good or bad because people were winning or losing. Naga says, okay, okay, I'm not complaining, but I didn't know that a singular two minute and 30 second ad was possible on Twitch. I run three minutes of ads every hour to make sure that pre-roll ads don't occur. It's the easiest way to support me as a streamer, as it is with everyone else who runs ads on their channel. It does very, very little for numbers, but it is appreciated at the end of the month when we get to look at a small, tiny little boost to whatever earning might be. Diesel says 50 v 50 repair tools. I have, you have no idea how nostalgic that would be. Naka says I'm all for support. I just didn't know that I could get a singular ad that long. I've seen ads for five minutes before. There are options much higher than three minutes. And I just, I don't know. They exist. They're a great time to get water. They're a great time to stretch, do other things. Okay. Yeah, exactly. Great time to do the dishes. That used to be the thing. It used to be when commercials happened, you would sprint to the bathroom if you had to, sprint to the kitchen to get a snack and some water, do half a task, and then come back and watch the rest of whatever you're watching. In ye oldie times. I'm gonna sit on this thermal vent because I don't want those guys to show up. I don't know where these eel are. I just don't. I, I don't get it. I don't understand the eel situation. Come on. There you go. Crimson says, I still forgot that I can pause things sometimes. My brain goes into 90s mode. Yeah, exactly. It's like, and that's another thing. People have... Can someone real quick for me redeem scare away the young people? Does anyone have the points that they'd like to spend for this? Because I think it'd be funny. Can you do me this solid? Unless I got rid of it. And if I did, then that sucks. I'll, I'll reactivate it later. What is this? Do, 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 do. Oh, it's not active right now. Okay, fine. I'll do it anyway. So, 
the notion of being able to pause things, especially things you're viewing as opposed to actively engaging in, is still one that is, is well and truly beyond when you're in kind of a just a watch mode and you're of a certain age bracket because it, it didn't used to be a thing pausing something was like just the greatest thing ever when it happened when he could do it to live television or live content it was literally mind altering and amazing and I'm sure that's fascinating for people But it's one of those things you can look at and just boggle your own mind. It's like, there was a time when I could not do this. Like there was, there was legitimately a long period of time where this was not a possibility for me. I keep, I, I think I keep passing this section. I don't think I actually look back here. I think maybe I know why. Come on, just let me get to the vent. I don't want to get eaten. Oh, he's coming. He's coming. Oh, no. We flee. Gross. Yeah, the notion that you could just pause and go do something else for a while. That, that was a big one. It was a, a moment where you're like, huh. I've taken control of my media. I I have the power now. I have spent 20 minutes looking for these fucking eels and I cannot find them. Diesel flanking speed. Action stations. Boop, boop, doo. Also, hi to YouTube. You're going to listen to a whole rant and have no idea why it happened. Hi. Uh, <laughs> General Quarters. General Quarters. Action stations. Yes, indeed. I haven't played World of Warships in forever. Crimson says, I forgot to tell you I love the new emotes. Type in exclamation point emotes for me, because that will take you directly to a link that will get you to Bedoink's page. They were the one I commissioned for these. I also love them. I love how they turned out. And I think everybody should go drop them a follow. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. That's the one. Diesel says, how to trigger a Navy vet. Is that? Oh, I'm sorry. To anybody listening, I apologize. Love that kid there. Yeah, exactly. They're they're awesome. I would absolutely recommend them if you are looking for emotes of your own. It was a smooth process. Everything was good. That's a turtle. We've never seen a turtle before. Not in this game. Hey, buddy. What are you doing here? I'm just gonna putter along behind you. Are you are you friendly? Are you gonna attack me? Are you gonna turn into some sort of monster and just rip my boat to pieces? Look at him. Oh, you can't now. He's covered in sea foam. There you go. Look at him. I've actually seen one up this close. In the wild. It's really cool. It's just, just chill little creatures. Have a good day. Eel. Are you the type of eel I need? If we finish this thing that we've... No, it's a fucking gray eel. God damn it. I need cusk eels. Diesel says some mariners are just built different. I have known plenty of them. I have had good experiences with quite a few and then horrible experiences with quite a few more. So 
I would agree that the average submariner is built different. However, an average surface, surface fleet individual tends to be also built different. Oh, okay. Uh, we need to get through those, but we need to not get invaded. Diesel says, and there's one channel I sometimes for frequent that man sometimes for shits and grins just goes in naval PA system mode. Awake those asleep. Indeed. Attention all hands. Now hear this. I don't know where to go. I spent a long time looking for eels, and they were the wrong ones. That's my song. Stay the fuck away from my boat, because I know you're not real. You're probably also not real. Comes as says, I've helped to hatch... Snapping turtle eggs, we saved them from some teenagers, dad stopped them, took care of them, and later returned them when they were hatched. Nice. A little bit of rescue action. Diesel says, attention all hands, as he'll be doing sick kickflips on the forecastle deck. Sick tricks. This is the wrong tab. I clicked into the wrong thing. I need you to repair my broken boat. Thank you. I also have all these eel I didn't need that I need to sell you so I can find the eel I do need, which is becoming a quest in and of itself. I'm also sleep till daylight because I'm tired of having to flick the light on and off. Back in the swamp. I guess that's where I belong. I, too, am an onion. You are not the fish I need. You are, you are an imposter fish. You are... What are these? Oh, I don't need those either. No, these aren't them. Okay, that wasn't something coming to eat me. I thought that was. That was the mangrove itself deciding I can't go places. Which is just excellent. That fish is a spy. Oh, that brought back a, a core memory unlocked situation. Did anyone else in the early 2000s... Like, 2006-ish watch a YouTube channel called Chad Vader? Is that a thing anyone else bothered to experience at any point? I am curious. Diesel. Diesel, that scares me. There's a spy by the beats. <laughs> There's a spy by the beats. There's a Spy by the Beats became a thing that a, a number of my friends at the time would just randomly say to each other, completely out of context, and it, it would legitimately concern people if we were in a location that was public. Wait, no, I blew this up. Use explosives. I have packed explosives. What happened to my packed explosives? Oh, I used them. My name is Hal Thompson, and I am an expert. Yeah, basically. I think that was around the same time that uh, The Whitest Kids You Know was starting to come onto the scene, and then Kids in the Hall also had a bit of a resurgence. Don't do discovery music when I haven't discovered things. Thor's Kitchen was also good. I don't think I watched Thor's Kitchen. I don't remember. It was ages ago. Years past. Many moons have since transpired above us. 
danced across the sky and out of our view. I just hit some mushrooms. I am going to spend the rest of this stream looking for these fucking eels. <laughs> it's gonna happen. Nope, those aren't them. How about back here? What is that? That's an alligator. Uh, hi. Alright. Okay, alright. Sheep says eel stream? You, uh, yes, sure. Do you do you want me to eat eel on stream? The easiest way to do that is just Uber eats it to me, and then I'll sit here and we can ASMR the eel eating sushi stream. And it will be horrifying for everyone involved. So if you wanna if you wanna get that together, thank you for volunteering. I appreciate it. I don't think it's on throne though. I, I mean, I've got stuff on throne, but I don't think eel stream is there. But I can add it if enough people want me to. Diesel says, anytime I talk about shows from the early 2010s, some of my friends always rebuke with, "Bro, I was too. What the fuck are you on about?" E yeah. The the problem with being an elder millennial is. There are things that people who are full-ass adults now just do not understand. Three people just left when I said that. <laughs> they didn't. It's fine. Twitch's numbers are still really fucky. Ah! Crimson says, I was not too. Yes, I'm, I'm aware. Please also no ages in chat. We can allude to things, but remember your internet safety. Do not tell me or anyone else in chat what your age is. Don't spread that around. And don't give out identifying information. That's not that's not a thing that we need. I already did the scare away the youth shtick. Why so many scary noises? Why? Diesel says that in Gmod stop motion. Yes. Yes, all of the, the current meme, pre-meme stuff was from then. Please actually be eel. I know there are gray eels here now, but I need the other ones. Getting the distressing notion I'm just not going to find them. Okay, I don't think they're in Twisted Strand. They're not in Gale Cliffs, and they're not in Devil's Spine, which means we have to go back to Stellar Basin and the giant fuck-off octopus. Ah! Running silent. No lights. No sound. We're just gonna press south until we can't anymore. By that I mean until we hit our location, because I know what happens if we keep going and don't don't stay close to shore. Nah. Something stole something out of my hold. Oh, oh no no wait 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 wait. There's nothing out that way. I'm not doing that again. Oh shit. Oh okay. Uh I know what that sound means. I know what that sound means. I think. It's out there. It's out there somewhere. I know it. I know it. Ugh. Ah! Ah! Cheese. Cheese! Thank you, Lada. How's it going? Uh. Battle stations! Battle stations! Yes, your winged cheese is much appreciated. I, I, I thank you. This is a lonely looking island. Why are you here? Do you have eel? I just, I just need the cusk eels. Once we get those, we're good. We're golden. 
You have wreckage. You have snappers. You have... Disappointed me. You have disappointed me as an island. You you failed to provide what I need, and I despise this situation. I keep expecting the thing to pop out of the water over that way and just decimate my boat. It, I'm not looking forward to it. Okay, back at the fortress. We haven't encountered the eel before. Shark! I'm gonna take that aboard. Come here. Ah, oh, good old friendly hammerhead. Perfect. Boop. Leggy thing hath conjured forth cheese. Yes, yes. Many cheeses. Many cheeses. To you as well. Uh, cheese be upon you. The cheese. Wait. Hold on. You're all suddenly very energetic and that makes me nervous. Nobody's this energetic this late in the stream. What's happening? What's going on? What'd you do? Who, who amongst you did what? Cheesed to meet you? No. Cease. You were revived by cheese magic. Those fish just straight up fucking disappeared. <laughs> uh, I don't like it. Uh, well, I don't like it. I want it. We're leaving. Hey, look, again, so everybody who's thrown cheese or said cheese or otherwise done things with cheese. Tell me what type of cheese it is. It was real dark. What is the preferred cheeses? Oh, that's just silly looking. Gazing shark. Okay. The kind that goes in a trebuchet. Okay, so again, we're, Sheebs is stuck on, on projectile cheese. Diesel found onions. Hello, welcome. With onions, good. Crimson loves Gouda. Jeremy. What kind of cheese? That is a $500 shark. That was a $70 mistake. It's a $17 mistake. Holy shit. <laughs> I have meatballs! We're most of the way to, to spaghetti at this point. Does anyone have tomatoes? And pasta. We need noodles and pasta... Pasta sauce. So we've got garlic, we've got tomatoes... Potentially, we've got cheese. I'm making myself hungry. This is not helpful. What are these lights? What do you mean? What is this? What are you? Oh. Interesting. Okay, Sheeb's found pasta. We have cheese. We have meatballs. We've got uh, garlic. Lada brings pine cones and coffee. Delicious, the crunch builds character. Okay, pine cone coffee, maybe. That doesn't sound too unappealing. So we have a drink with dinner. Do we have any bread? Does anybody have bread? Holy shit. Do we have garlic bread? Because I, I realize it's possibly the most stereotypical thing ever, but you can't do spaghetti and meatballs without garlic bread. We're assembling dinner on stream. Thank you very much for this. This is great. This is perfect. I was very hungry. Lada has bread cat. I don't think we can eat that. I don't think that's gonna... That's not gonna kind of soap... Like, you can't bring up the sauce with, with a bread cat. 
Sheep says I should actually add a bread emote. You sh yes, considering, you know, everything. You absolutely should. Diesel says, damn it, could have sworn Phil's had a bread emote. Oh, so we, we thought we had bread. So we're going to be breadless, is what you're telling me. We're going to have pasta, meatballs, and no bread. Well, now I'm, I'm slightly disappointed in this. I thought we were working together. I thought we had something going. And you've just, you've taken the whole concept. And you've left it half fulfilled. It's not even, it's not even good. It's just... It's just there. Why would you do this? Are tanks edible? If you try hard enough. I mean, realistically, if you try hard enough, anything's edible. But there are plenty of things you shouldn't. I would say armored vehicles are one of them. I've given up on the eel. I don't think they exist. Hammerheads, though, very valuable. Enjoy the liquid bread. Liquid bread! Hey, there you go. I see. Beer, got it. Yeah, I mean, maybe, but I still think bread is necessary. And also, do we have any greens? Do we have a salad, some antipasta? Or have we shunned those as well? Cool. Beans? Do you want beans? You gotta. Those cost money now. You gotta. You gotta pay chaos coins for beans. I give them away for free every now and again. Crimson has cookies, nice. Salad is green, the devil is green, ergo salad is the devil. No, salad and like, like antipasta that ensalada stuff. Like you need you need a little bit of a palate cleanse. So if you do like a little bit of greens in between your first and second course, good. Or or even the whole meal and then the salad, maybe. Yeah, you know, those things those things work. It's not going to kill you, I promise. They're, they're healthy. They're good for you. Unless you've got a dietary restriction, at which point ignore what I just said. Again, take everything with a grain of salt, I suppose. Unless you can't have salt. Uh, you know. Be kind to yourself. Crimson also has popcorn. I, okay, so we're assembling everything but the meal that we had been working so hard on. It sounded like we had pasta. We had everything we needed but tomatoes to make the sauce. So we had garlic. We had meat. You know, those things. And now we, we're back to... We've got popcorn, the beans for some reason. I've heard nobody mention olives of any variety. We've got no fish. We've got, like... There's no, there's no sardine action. There's no, like, any sort of seafood involved. You don't like olives? Apparently a bunch of people don't. I don't like green olives. I like black olives. They're fine. And Kalamata olives are legitimately the devil. If you touch food after having looked at Kalamata olives, that food then tastes like them. If you show food Kalamata olives, it tastes like them. Looking for eel. I really don't like that thing below us. Okay, we got fish. We got fish. Cool. So we've got some potentially sardine action happening. Maybe some anchovies. Does anyone have olives? Does anyone have olive oil? Does anyone have, like, any sort of thing which might go with the fish? Yes, no. Does anyone have coffee that we can have while we wait for everybody to find the rest of dinner? 
That is an explosive, and I don't need to go right towards it. Do, do you are bugs. You are also bugs. You have salt. Excellent. Perfect. And we've got coffee. Hey, Crimson understood the assignment. <laughs> Hey, well done. Gold star. Gold star. Boop. That is coffee. It's a cup of madness. It's coffee with madness in it. It's madness included. Also anglerfish. Imbibe. No. Not yet. I have a very limited amount of water. Next to me. No. Oh, okay, that didn't damage us. That's good. Those are octopus. This would also be a great eel habitat. They just don't exist. No. No. Maybe they're day dwellers. Crimson has water and is making tea. Throw in the microwave for me, would you? Ooh, shiny. Collection of cases have washed up against the shore. Some have already spilled open and they lost their contents to the waves. We found photography equipment. Sweet, I need a new camera. This works. It's probably to do with the photographer that went missing. Never. Okay, well, I mean, you don't have to be as forceful about it. You can't just don't say never to something without knowing. Get away from my fish. Get away from my fish. Get away from my fish. Go away, burbs. Fuck off. God damn it. You took a sword. Oh, I thought that said swordfish. I was like, how the fuck does one... Burb, carry away a whole ass swordfish. There have to be. The, the eel have to live here. They just do. There's no fucking way they don't. We've been everywhere else. Everywhere else has not had them, so... What are you? You are a barracuda. What are you? I don't remember what you are. You're probably Grouper. Yeah, Grouper. Diesel says, had to resort to strong tea yesterday. No coffee in this household. That is unfortunate, and I'm so very sorry for you. Barracuda... Give me something wiggly and long that looks vaguely violent. What are you? Well, I need these anyway, I think. Loose jaws. Loose jaw. Not what I need. Oddly enough, the coffee at Ikea is very good. I learned through the years. I need to go to an Ikea. I do. Again, I need a couple of blahages. I need a couple more. I need some shelves for a project. And then I need some wall shelves for some equipment. So, Ikea soon. Maybe I'll do some of their meatballs and coffee. That's more loose jaws. What are you? Where the fuck are the eels? I just... I don't know. Okay, I, I don't know. I'm gonna be pissed if they're back in, like, Little Morrow, that area. What is this? This is a different cultist. 
Another a sacrifice. They pointed another shape on the scroll. This one looks like a fang tooth. Too bad I don't have one. I don't even know where to get them. Are you fang tooth? No. Then again, the machine was one of those in bolt grinder thingy. Oh well. I would love something that extravagant. I just have a Mr. Coffee at the moment because Keurig keeps destroying itself every time I get a new one. Not that I recommend them. They're just the easiest. Although an espresso. Ah, uh, I shouldn't think about coffee. I have none. Also, do crimes for an espresso machine. I don't. I don't know. I. I'm getting to the point where I've. I think we've been everywhere, and I just can't find these eels. I don't know what to look for. Every time I find something that looks like an eel, it's not the right thing. I. I don't get it. What is this? What are you? No, you're octopus. Very pretty, not the thing we're looking for. Drip coffee machine. Oh, it's not a drip coffee machine. It's a it's a knockoff Keurig essentially, but the um Nespresso machines look really cool. And honestly, I've got space for one in the room that this computer is in. And that would make a lot of things much easier. <laughs> uh, but there are other priorities before that, so. Brain going numb. Brain, brain not braining well anymore. Brain warm. Eel elusive. Coming up on our two hour mark. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna look one more time. So we're gonna go from here at Stellar Basin, over to the Maros, and then up at Steel... So we're going to go essentially northeast, past the lighthouse, to look for eel. If we don't find them this time, then we are definitely done for the evening. Because I will have no idea where they are, and we need them for a quest. So we're going to skirt around our friendly tentacle beast. Uh, and make tracks northeast. Hey, that rhymed. I, I did a rhyme. Look at me go. I'm weirdly proud of myself. It's a bad one, but I mean, still proud of myself. Out in the open waves, the day dawns orange. The sounds from the deep, disturbing. Something, something, Northwest Passage, Stan Rogers <laughs> reference. I mean, there's currently enough ice go oh, hey friend nope no 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 what the fuck <laughs> wait wait a minute wait a minute wait a minute uh did, did anyone did anyone see jaws decide he had to nope jaws noped he like wiggled no at my boat and left Uh, what? What? Oh, there's a water spout. We gotta go. Okay, um, that's... Wait. No, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. Are, are you... Is that you again? Yeah, Bruce decided to not. Bruce... Bruce just sank like a rock. Okay, that's a no. That's not what we were looking for. Interesting. 
there have been a lot of weird like surface creatures which we can't catch this this game. Ah. Serial killers of the sea. Maybe that's why Bruce noped. Did you know that great whites have been known to flee an area for years after spotting orcas or, or fighting orcas in a, in a space? They are so terrified of orcas that they leave and do not come back regardless of how prominent food sources are. Eel! If this is it. If this is it. I'm gonna be pissed. Oh, thank God they're great eel. Okay, this isn't the one we needed. Cool. Excellent. That would have been awful. Okay, what about you? What are you? What kind are you? You also look like gray eel. You are. Okay. Good. Good. We are not going northeast. That way is northeast. What are you? I heard you, but I can't see you, and that's not good. The banishing words can dispel the most evils for a time? Reap the corpses of any fish in your sight's long range. What? Uh, what? Atrophy. Reap the corpses of any fish in your sight's long range. What does this mean? Let's turn lights on. This is a power we got from the book. Also, one of Moose's predators involves orcas. Yes, because Moose, diving Moose, absolutely. That's also an absurd thing that people don't really know until it is explained to them. Oh! We can do magic. We are a wizard. Amazing. Strange, almost necromantic powers. What was looking at me from the side, though? There was something over here. I'm a boat wizard. I'm, I'm a boat wizard. Fear me. I am the boat wizard. What are you? Oh, you're different. You're a different shape. Are you the one I need? Sprouting eel. Okay, all right. That's a conger eel. We need these, but not for the fucking quest. Oh, you sons of bitches. Banish. We will banish. Become boat wizard again. Uh oh. Uh oh. Now I'm the Ganglerfish. It's me. Amazing. Can I turn it off though? I can. Cool. Sweet. Okay. I'm I have to call it here. I, I'm looking at the clock. I do actually have a couple of things that need to be wrapped up before work tomorrow. I can't find these eel. 
that's fine. We will absolutely come back for more dredge, which gets a little stranger every time. As well as our own weird floundering in it. So let's look at the sunset. Or right, nope, let's not, because that, that funnel cloud is gonna, funnel, the fucking water spout is gonna ruin it, of course. Hold on. That's the sunrise, because it's in the east. You know, that, that makes sense. Uh, we <laughs> gonna go ahead and throw on the ending screen. Okay. If you haven't seen this yet, by the way, the thing running back and forth here, uh, that guy who just went past my nose, that's Blurg. Blurg is going to become our TTS chat buddy. I'm about halfway through animating him to a point where I'm happy with him, uh, but he is definitely going to be a feature. He's in the Discord, in the art section with some concept and a little bit of cleanup needed. Um, you should go have a look. Also, the Discord is just a great place to hang out, play games, and do things off stream. Uh, I will be live again tomorrow with uh, Tarkov, because it's Monday. And then again on Thursday with uh, Sons of the Forest, where we're going to start cutting down the entirety of the island on stream. It's going to be really boring at start. However, I think we can do it. I think we can actually make it happen. Um, and so I'm kind of excited about that. Don't forget, you can find me on TikTok and you can find me on YouTube. Uh, TikTok is especially active uh, with Twitch clips. YouTube is great for VODs. So if you missed part or you know, more than half of today's stream and you'd be interested in going back and playing the rest, you can find it there. Next day, at least the next day after a stream. Who's doing what? Who can we go see? Uh, yeah, YouTube or TikTok. Uh, both will work. Links also works to everything. Like, show up to everything from Throne to the Discord. Uh, well, no, the Discord's not on there, but Throne to TikTok as well. Um, it's a good place to find all the stuff and extra ways you can support the channel if you'd like. Let's go see some. Um. Who's live that I know? Is anyone live that I know? Oh, you know what? We didn't get to raid on Friday, so everybody go ahead and do yourselves a favor and turn down the volume to about 5% of what it's at right now. You will thank me later. We're going to go see Jal. Jal is doing uh, some sort of role play thing. I'm not sure what, but it'll be a good time. Yes. So turn down your volume. Go say hello to Joel. They do some uh, just absolute chaos, which anyone should indeed be able to enjoy. Thank you, Mookie. Thank you, everybody, for being here. Crimson Diesel. I, I can't possibly list everybody because I don't have enough caffeine. But if, if you were here and I was talking with you, I appreciate you. Thank you for the new follows as well. I hope that you enjoy what you saw and that you come back tomorrow evening at 7 p.m. Pacific. I'm going to start this raid now and then immediately disappear for caffeine. And we'll see everybody tomorrow. So you can tell my brain is, is starting to slow down because I'm, I'm just rambling on and on. So I'm going to push this button. And we're going to see who comes along. Hey, ready? Everybody ready? If you have tentacles, go ahead and start flashing them in Jaws chat and we'll do the thing. Here we go.